Hello, good friends. It's the Twy King, and thanks for joining me for the next Amiibo Party board of Mario Party 10. Today's board happens to be the. Hey, we finally said his name correctly. <laughs> I think uh, when I used Toad's board, he didn't even say his name on there, so at least uh, Yoshi is smart enough to say his name on there. <laughs> and my goodness, look at all that green on there as well as um, all those multicolored Yoshis right there. It's... I think this is only my second time ever playing the Yoshi board, but let's just go ahead and get it started. Am I going last? No, I'm going third. <laughs> So I have no idea what's on all these quadrants right here, it's just going to be a wait and see what happens on all these. <laughs> that egg <laughs> in the upper left is definitely going to be uh, something of high interest. Unfortunately, it looks like Toad has a good opportunity to get that first star right away by going four or five spaces. Hopefully that doesn't happen. Okay. Uh, that's better than moving five spaces forward and getting the... First star on the first turn. I think I would prefer rolling a two or a five. Yeah, I just wanted to listen to his theme song for just a little bit to see how it sounds right on there, but let's just go ahead and get him rolled. Oh, the dice almost landed on him. I rolled a five, so I have a chance to move five spaces forward. Let's hope it happens. And I got it! Okay! Star on the first turn. That hardly ever happens. At least I beat Toad out to it. And the next one is conveniently right up there. And I could get a five dice block token right there. I still gotta earn some coins though. Peach gonna move five spaces too. Of course she is. And in fact, she may even beat me to it. But she's one space back of me simply because the star space earlier occupied one other. A okay, Fuzzy Flyers. A game that I can win. Okay, I just want to make sure I know the controls right away. It's just simply using the D-pad. Moving up, down, left, and right. Don't get hit by fuzzies. <laughs> I still keep getting beat to the punch on most of these clouds. And Beach is trying to be a jerk right there, knocking me into a fuzzy. Can I avoid this one? No. Yeah. Oh, at least I still got time back. Oops. I don't know how much more is left. Rosalina is running out of time. Ooh, got seven more seconds. Alrighty. <laughs> Even more. Well, I should be able to survive, but can I uh, get to the finish first? Please don't mess around with me. <laughs> we all finished first. Maybe it really isn't a race. It's just, um... Make sure you get up to the top. Well, I'll definitely take 10 coins. I still gotta win another minigame. Or will that egg thing up in that corner give me coins? That would be great if it does. Yoshi Cannon. What's it shooting out? Shooting an egg at Rosalina and giving her dice block to Toad. 
Okay. So it looks like these mechanical Yoshis want to steal dice blocks. <laughs> Rosalina got even more screwed. Alrighty. I still want a low roll here. That works. And I definitely want this. In case I really need to make a move. I could move four or five spaces here, but give me five coins, that would be great. Or even a special dice block, that works fine. Alrighty. Ooh, the reverse dice block! That would work great if I uh, go past the star with few coins and um, I win enough on the next turn and I can use that reverse to get back to that star over there. Um, Peach still has way more than enough. I just gotta make sure I beat her out to it. But I don't want her tying me up so fast. Alright, we got a new minigame, Steal the Beat. I'm on the team of three. Solo player, drum with A and two. Rivals, match the band leaders. Rhythm. Well, at least the buttons are right on the bottom. So, I probably shouldn't have too much of a problem here. Oh, jeez. That's a lot right there. Well, at least I didn't screw up, but fortunately Peach did. Almost no breaks there. Okay, we're up to five mistakes. Final round. I think we should be fine as long as... That's a lot more notes. Feels like it. Alright. Made a couple mistakes right there, but hey. Still one in the end. And I already have enough coins now for that star, I think. Or is it, um... Or am I still five short? If this actually would have been a solo minigame, I probably would have had enough coins. Yeah, I still only have 15 coins, so let's just see what we get on the normal. <laughs> kind of funny to knock uh, Peach and Toad over like that. Only three coins, though. Alright, here goes Peach. Can she roll a one? To land in the warp pipe? No. She's gonna get that star. But what the transform egger? You don't have any special dice blocks, so here's one for you. Okay, so this thing is designed to... ...change the dice block that you have into something maybe better. I don't know if they may do it into something worse. Also. Way in that corner. I hope I get a chance to acquire that Bowser token right there. Now, if I win enough, uh, if I win this mini game and have enough coins, I will definitely use the five dice block token. Ugh. Well, it's gonna kind of suck being the solo player for, or no, no, the uh, team of three for this one because I have to check, or I have to count all these cheap cheats. I mean, 
Really gotta think back to roll call days of Mario Party 2. See what we got. One, two, three, four, five. And... Just making an ultimate guess of 17. Uh, oh, there's 16. I was off by one again. I mean, I remember the last time I did this on the team of three and I was off by one. I was off by one again. So I still can't get that next star. Don't have any special death blocks? No. <laughs> yeah, let's see what my reverse death block could become. Or could Toad switch places with me? Ooh. Can it be me? Alrighty! So I have a little head start to that next star. Don't have enough coins, but. At least I'm giving myself a slight head start over Peach. Everyone else. I ain't gonna use the five uh, dice yet. Because I don't have enough coins. Three. Alright, well at least that is gonna put me above 20. Okay, so Peach just got ahead of me right there, but that's fine. I'm only, uh, seven spaces from that star. I should be able to get it with the five dice block. Keep away mayhem. So I'm on the team of three here. Instead of the solo player. The Being the solo player was extremely brutal. So, Rivals uh, controls is to just... Pass the ball with A1 or 2. Okay, so whatever button I'm standing on, I had to press the button that's not mine. Let's see. Okay, so I can't press A since I'm on that myself. Oh. <laughs> Jeez. Near misses by Rosalina. Oh, Peach! That was your fault. Yeah, Peach, why didn't you kick it to me? You know Roro was going in that direction. So Toad gets to do this again. But he actually has a dice block for it. So putting that in is going to give him... Two of those now. That he can only use one per turn. Does Rosalina have any? No. <laughs> Special dice blocks are just hard to come by. Well, at least I can now use my... 5 dash. Hmm, 16's a pretty high roll. Uh, I'll take a star any way I can. And the next one's way over there. <laughs> 
No, I'm not acquiring the peach token. Ooh. Could I get five coins from this? Alrighty. I'll definitely take those. Man, all those weird bounces that Dice Walk took. <laughs> Pretty weird. Bullet Bill Bullies. Peach is the solo player. All she has to do is avoid the bullet bills by moving uh, left and right on that thing. <laughs> All we have to do is press 2 to fire while aiming the cannons. I think she has to be hit three times to be eliminated. Not just one time. Yeah. Okay, one hit. She, 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 she has to be somewhat cornered right there with all those bullet bills coming to her. Seriously. Dang. She just totally stole that one. She definitely better not reach that next star. Tota Rosalina should definitely beat her to it. Actually, this will help Toad out, because he is going to be warping. Yep, he's definitely going to beat Peach to it. Oh, here comes Rosalina landing on Bowser. This could affect all of us, let's see. Uh, nope, just uh, Rosalina herself. Lose five coins. Okay, um, I still don't have enough coins. If I did, I would use that reverse dice block. And that's not a good space to land on. And even though she's warping where Toad is, she still ain't gonna make it to that star. So it's still going to beat her out to it. Now we get a free-for-all, <laughs> where I could potentially win more coins. Alright, snake block. Let's not make a major screw-up like I did that last time. Where I just simply walked off when um, we were near the finish. Make sure that doesn't happen again. Jeez, everyone is just so close to just pushing each other off. Not kidding. Ugh. It's very nerve-wracking when I'm being pushed like that. I came in last. Eh, ah, whatever. I think I was just being too careful at the very end, making sure I wouldn't fall. But I was still getting pushed back as well. Yeah. 
Unfortunately, Toad still has enough for at least one more. But at least that's only his first, and that star is within Rosalina's reach. Or wait, he's gonna reach it. No? Why is he going right there? He could have just gone to that war pipe near where Rosalina is. What's he thinking? <laughs> Robo's getting screwed here. Yeah, she's gotten screwed over quite a lot today. Alrighty. So I'm going to land on that special dice block, but let's see what the Aegir does. Could I perhaps get a different result? Than what Toad did? Nope. Same one. But, I'll definitely replace one of those with whatever I get right here. Yes, definitely. So I can still reach that one star down there. I can just win more mini games and um, get there before the final round ends. Only three rounds left. Got to get high dice rolls, as well as mini game wins. Cheap, cheap leap again. I always seem to get screwed over on this one on Master Difficulty because um, players just keep jumping in my way. It's kind of hard to even see what my number is. Ooh, that's a good combo right there. Did I get that gold one at the far right? I don't... Oh, very close scores. I still got second place. It looked like I was in the lead for quite some time, but um, I just couldn't get good patterns of cheap cheeps coming to me. Oh well. Yeah, I'm just pretty much hanging on for dear life right here. <laughs> have to have the most stars, but pretty much the least amount of coins. Uh, if only I could get 40 coins in the last uh, three turns. Oh, I see what Toad was doing. I know why he went to that warp pipe space right there, because he had that dice block. Luckily, he only was only able to afford just one of those. Well, that puts him in the lead. And the next ones are way over there, which is not great. Do you get to pick who you want to steal dice from, or is it just random? <laughs> Jeez, what a knockover of my uh, token right there. I wonder what happens if you meet the uh, anger with um, two dice blocks already in your possession. Hmm. <laughs> well, let's hope I can roll a five here. Nope. Six coins, okay. So where does that put me coins-wise? 
against Toad. Okay, so if I can get a 1 next turn, if I win this minigame, I could land on that warp pipe space, go down to near where that star is at the corner, and then get it on the last turn. But, gotta win this first. If I get second place, though, I can still get to 20. But, I'd still rather win this. I'm just gonna follow where my uh, rivals go, for the most part. Oh, those two fell down. <laughs> Alrighty! I almost screwed up when in the last five seconds. Not kidding. All right, if I can roll a one this turn, I might be okay, but, um, does Toad have enough coins for one or both of those stars? I think he does, unfortunately. We'll have to check the standings when it's my turn. Heh, <laughs> he's aiming for me. Uh, I pretty much didn't need that anyway. Alright. Oh, I'm ahead of Toad by four coins. And he will have enough just to get one of those stars right there. He's definitely going to use his 456 dice block on his last turn. So I'm probably screwed anyway. Ugh. If Peach can come up with a clever way to steal his coins, which is probably not going to happen. Another possible, another way that could that could help me out is to uh, have Peach swap places with Toad, but then she may be able to get that um, star on the last turn, and she'll overtake me with three stars. Uh, looks like I'm gonna lose this game no matter what happens. But, uh, hold on a minute, if I switch places with Toad, come on! That's not gonna help. If Toad could be stupid and not use his 456, I have a chance to overtake him for that. Well, I guess that's fine for Peach. Alright, crucial final round here. I don't have to win this minigame, but let's just see what happens. Boo burglars. Can I be the one with the net? Like, please make me be the one with the net. No. I hate being the one with the flashlight because my teammate just doesn't know how to get to me fast enough. See? <laughs> it's just really unfair being the flashlight person.
I don't even know where I'm going. At least not many more coins were at stake in this one, otherwise... Toad could have got some. Two more stars at once. Well, let's see if he'll be stupid and use something other than this four, five, six. Nope. If only this star would just stay right there. That other star would have just stayed right there. Probably could have overtaken Toad. Let's go. Wait a minute. Rosalina may actually help me out here. Where is the next set appearing at? Way up there. Still too far away. Eh. Ah. Well, pretty much nothing I can do here. I don't think any special event is going to help my cause. Not even going four or five spaces. <laughs> Yeah, just a pretty rough ending right there. <laughs> and I fell to third place. Definitely had to do with, uh... Rosalina getting that, uh, set of stars right there. And having more coins than me. Ten points. Yeah, on the very first turn, it looked like I may have a good inside track to really keep going, but um, not much could go my way. It really couldn't. As uh, some stars were just definitely put out of place for me, and some mini games didn't help my cause either. Yeah. But anyways, that's going to do it for this edition of Mario Party 10, the Yoshi Amiibo board. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you for watching. I will see you good friends next weekend for the next Bowser Party board, which will be uh, Whimsical Waters on Team Mario. And then the next Amiibo board on next Sunday will be the Rosalina Amiibo board. <laughs> yep, Rosalina's board will be next. Thanks for watching, everyone. Have an awesome day. So long.